Hi everyone, awesome with Sun Fun Kits. So we want to make this video because we keep getting some of these uh, customers, some of our customers having some unpleasant experiences, and it has to do with a 200 amp uh, BMS. So many people are probably familiar with this. Uh, it's a JBD or Giabata uh, 200, and it's made by a company called LTT Power for JBD, and this is the SFK 200. Now, uh, to the average person, they'll say, aha, clearly at Sun Fun Kits, you've just relabeled JBD. And I understand how that could be because they are similar design. Uh, the reason for that is the company that manufactures both this is called LTT. LTT Power, uh, Lithium Battery PCB. But that external list is really how uh, far the similarities go. So the Giabata 200 can run up to 12 volts in series. So you can parallel multiple one of these, but you cannot put more than, uh, you know, 12 in series. So if you try to do a 24 volt or 36 volt setup, or, or even a 48 volt setup, you will fry this BMS. It cannot handle it. The SFK, on the other hand, can handle anywhere from uh, 12 to 24 to 36 to 48 volts in series. So it is using a different set of MOSFETs and other circuitry that allow this to be connected to four in series. So there you go. Of course, you're not going to believe me. So let's open them up. So if we've taken the screws off these and let's look at the internals. So we see some MOSFETs and I will have the part numbers for this, but these are generally 12 volt rated. Now let's take off the SunFun Kits SFK200. And as you can see, it is different. You see that? And you see this. Also notice the heat sink is slightly different as well. So the internals are not exactly the same. Uh, these MOSFETs allow the SFK200 to go up to four in series. And as you can see, even on the PCB, we have that stated, if it gets into focus, uh, we have that stated clearly, so you can see the PCB itself is different. So if you're wanting to have a setup that can support more than 12 from series, the SFK200 is able to do that while still maintaining heating functionality. But if all you need is 12 volts, the JBD is a decent choice. However, do not connect this and this unit in series. The SFK will survive, the JBD will not. And unfortunately, we have seen uh, some customers contact us saying that they fried their JBD when they connected it to one of ours in 24 volt, and they re didn't realize that the JBD is only rated for 12. So please keep that in mind and make your setups accordingly. Thank you.